In the nearly 200 years that the Yingling Company in Schuylkill County has been around, it survived some of the toughest moments in America's history. And now America's oldest brewery is stepping up to help Americans get through this pandemic. Eyewitness News reporter Rachel Espayat explains. DG Yingling and Son Incorporated understands the struggle to survive through a hard time. Together we'll get through this. America's oldest brewery made it through the Spanish flu pandemic, prohibition, and many other obstacles thrown their way the last 191 years. A big part of the reason we've been able to survive is because we've looked out for the community and been able to lift people up that have helped, helped us over the years. While the family-owned business continues to operate, Yingling is reaching out and donating $100,000 to support those impacted by the pandemic. Yingling is focusing their efforts on the Gary Sinise Foundation to help first responders on the front line. The foundation also has a grant for emergency COVID-19 combat service. We have a natural tie with the military and it's been something that's always been near and dear to our hearts. Thank you to those who are helping us, from the doctors and nurses, to those who work tirelessly to make sure our shelves are stocked with food. Yingling is also donating to the Pennsylvania Restaurant and Lodging Association's Hospitality Assistance Response for Pennsylvania Fund to help workers in the hospitality industry. Cheers to you, cheers to our heroes, and cheers to brighter days ahead. The fifth and sixth generation Yinglings make a toast in support of those who are working through this crisis. In Pottsville, Rachel Espayat, Eyewitness News. If you donate Yingling's efforts, the company will match that contribution dollar for dollar up to $45,000. And if you'd like some more information, just go to our website, pahomepage.com.